Mr. President, it's General Carville at the Pentagon on Line 5. This is Dugan. Mr. President, I'm afraid we have a heck of a situation down here. How bad could it be, Ben? According to NORAD, we've got Soviet aircraft coming out of small directions and ground troops pushing up through Mexico. I don't know how they snuck in on us. You better double check this with NORAD. It just doesn't make any sense. I'll call the Kremlin. Will do. Da, Premier Romanov here. What's going on over there, Alex? Why, Mr. President? Whatever do you mean? Alex, I... I have, um... You're throwing everything you've got at us, Alex. We're supposed to be allies, you maniac. I'm the one that put you into office. Listen! Very carefully. I am not your pet, Mr. President. We Romanovs have our legacy to consider. I don't give a wooden nickel about your legacy. You call them off. Alex, you called them off. You know, we'll retaliate. Oh, don't be so sure, Mr. President. Sir, verification? You bet you. Sweet mother. It's time to hit back. Make it happen. Yes, sir. This is General Carville. Soviet invasion confirmed. Execute Long Charter 010 Adam Delta Charlie. Have confirmation. Missiles prime. Arm! Missile command. 10 seconds to launch. Open the missile silos. Jerry, what? We have to open the silos, or they'll explode under. Silo doors are closed! This is suicide! Is it done, Yuri? No, Comrade Premier. It has only begun. Commander, good morning. We've successfully instituted the President's Emergency Lazarus Protocol. I'm Lieutenant Eva, the intel officer assigned to your command. And since you're the only commander left alive, I guess I'm pretty lucky to have a job. It appears that we have suffered a full-scale Soviet invasion. Nearly all our major cities are under siege and our forces are in complete disarray. Please stand by, Commander. We have an incoming broadcast from General Carville at the Pentagon. I hope you're rested and ready, Commander, because as of 0800 hours, you are in control of every satellite, base, tank, airplane, enlisted man, woman, and child in the eastern United States. You answer to the President, and you answer to me. Your ops officer and vital lifeline will be the Lieutenant. Your point man for this mission will be Special Agent Tanya. General, I hope the Commander is up to speed, because we don't have time to waste. 
I'm sure Tanya has every confidence in you, Commander. Oh, you're sure? Well, it's not your life that's on the line out here. <laughs> She's the best there is, but you'll get along better with the Soviets. You'll get started immediately. First stop, New York. The lieutenant will give you the details. Not long ago, the Soviets made an amphibious landing on Manhattan Island and are using their ground troops to systematically take over the city. Fortunately, we still have a hold on Fort Bradley, but our comlink has been severed. If you can get Agent Tanya into Bradley, she will re-establish the link. Good luck, Commander. Establishing battlefield control. Stand by. The Soviet Navy is attacking the Statue of Liberty. We can't let them get away with that. Sir, is there anything you can do? Incoming transmission. Tanya here. Listen up. We got a couple commie dreadnoughts in the harbor. Looking for a special sightseeing tour of the Hudson River. I say we give them a very special view at the bottom first. Where's the party? Battle control online. <laughs> Unit promoted. <laughs> I offer special invitation to citizens of the United States and the Great Soviet Union. See your liberty, how she lies broken before you. In but a moment's time, your once powerful city of New York will follow in her footsteps. The choice is yours. You can continue to mourn your past or surrender. And join us in the Great Soviet Revolution! Move out, boss. Unit lost. Move out, boss. <laughs> Our ally is under You got an order? Congratulations. Take it, baby. We've re-established contact with Fort Bradley. Ready. They're turning over control of the base and its troops to you. Incoming transmission. Double time. Got it! Double time! Move Good work, Commander. We're back in contact with the fort. Tanya has sent over intel on the location of an important Soviet supply base in the area. General Carville would like you to dispose of it ASAP. Oh, keep up the good work, sir. Building. Sir, this is an engineer. He can repair any app. Looks like the bridge has collapsed. We'll have to get our engineers to repair it. Unit ready. I have the tools. Analyzing schematics. To ore miner under attack. Bridge repaired. Unit, watch out for those train arrows. They seem highly unstable. I have to do Primary objective achieved. Mission accomplished. Mr. President, the Europeans will be asking for our help before too long. Yes, sir. I'll take care of it. Just ain't right. We shouldn't have to beg for help from anyone. Premier Romanov's got that whole continent shaking in their boots. Romanov sending his bulldog general Vladimir in for our air bases. His forces are romping through the country like an angry bull at the Texas rodeo. At 0500 this morning, we detected a large force of Soviet tanks assembled near the Air Force Academy at Colorado Springs. Sir, urgent transmission from Agent Tanya in the field. It looks like the commies have captured the Academy, General. Well, why the devil did you wait till now to contact us? We can't let Vladimir take that air base. With all due respect, sir, we've been a little busy. Commander, get Tanya out of the hole she dug for herself and make her useful, would you? I'm sure she'll appreciate it. The heck? We seem to have lost Tanya's transmission. Go to it, Commander.
I've located a group of rocketeers in Colorado Springs. They're ready to move in on our orders. On my way! I've got the knowledge. I have a mission objective received. You got an order? Incoming transmission. On the move! And in short order, we will all, young and old, pledge allegiance to our new leader, Premier Romanov of the USSR. Commander, <laughs> your performance in Colorado was pretty darn impressive. But things have changed since you've been away fighting. The war is over. What I've come to realize is that the commies and us want the same things. You know, female I don't think we need to hear any more of that. Steak. It appears that the president and even General Carville are under the influence of a Soviet psychic beacon. It's a mind control device developed by this man. This is Yuri. Our intelligence sources now believe that Yuri and his psychic core are the ones responsible for compromising our defenses before the invasion. Right now, the Soviets control much of the population in the area. Oh, don't worry, Commander. I'm not red yet. Intelligence has not yet determined the exact location of the beacon, but you can be sure it will be heavily guarded by the Soviets. I can link you to all the unaffected troops in the area. Use them to destroy the beacon. With the beacon destroyed, the President will be free to secure a safer location. Establishing battlefield control. Stand by. This, sir, is our IFV. It is a multi-purpose raider capable of boosting the standard weapon capabilities of any infantryman inside. Battle control online. Building. Reinforcements have arrived. Primary objective achieved. Incoming transmission. Commander! Whatever it is we're paying you, it isn't enough. I don't know how you got us out of this mess, but I'm extremely grateful. After this is over, I'm going to promote you to whatever you like, except President. <laughs> Keep an eye out, Commander. I need you out there. Mission accomplished. I don't know what the Sam Hill happened back there, Commander. But as you can see, we're getting sent right here. I know, Canada. More cows up here than people. Well, let's get to work. The lieutenant will fill you in. It looks like General Vladimir just hit Chicago hard. The nearest available forces are across Lake Michigan. Intel suggests an amphibious assault across the lake. Well, I guess it's the first time for everything. Good luck, Commander. Establishing battlefield control. Stand by. Commander. Our destroyer is the workhorse of the Navy. No naval unit can long hide from it, and once detected, it makes short battle control online. Commander? New construction options. Incoming transmission. Unit report. High speed commencing assault. Commander, we have just received an intelligence report on Soviet activity in the Chicago area. This is a psychic amplifier. Our theory is that if turned on, it can do to the country what the psychic beacon did to Washington. General Carville wants you to find it and destroy it. Unit lost. Primary objective achieved. Incoming transmission. Commander, they never saw us coming. That was splendid. Hear me, you foul American phantom, wherever you are. You can work your armies like a puppeteer all you want, but this is my play. 
Here is the city that you have saved. Without the psychic amplifier, which you so rashly destroyed, I no longer have much use for it. Behold, the power of Mother Russia! Unit lost. Good afternoon, Commander. The President and the European Council are ready for you. Please hang on while I put you through. Ah, Commander, I'm glad you could make it. The European Council and I have been discussing an aid package... It's a possibility. The possibility of an aid package for the U.S. The nuclear attack on Chicago seems to have sparked their interest. Do not think us indifferent to your situation, Mr. President. But for us, the United States is very far away. Commander, the point is we've agreed to exchange Agent Tanya's services on this operation for soldiers and supplies from the Alliance. Provided our conditions are met, I am prepared to take command immediately. Now you just hold on a second, okay? This is my operation. We all need leaders, Agent. No? We have no time to train this guy, Mr. President. You want my men, you hook me up with my commander. And that's my condition. Very well. If you're on board, Commander, and it looks like you've been drafted, the Prime Minister will give you the details. The objects you see in the second photograph are Soviet missile silos. As you can see, Commander, they are a bit too close for comfort. I believe Romanov's intention is to keep us out of your war. Our men will go nowhere until this threat is eliminated. Take care of these silos. And this war may be close to an end. We're counting on you, Commander. Establishing battlefield control. Stand by. <laughs> Battle control online. Incoming transmission. On my way. Catching! Sir, be on the lookout for Soviet guard dogs. They've been released to sniff out our spies. Building infiltrated. Incoming transmission. It looks like we're in. Our spies have infiltrated the Soviets' battle labs and relayed the specs on their silo locations. I'm ready to rock and roll, Commander. So let's take out those silos and head on home. How about some action, baby? How about a target? I'm resizing the radar to compensate Take for the it, new baby. Looks like we're gonna need some more spies, sir. Take it. Vehicle rechanging position. You can check one missile off your list, sir. That bird will never fly. Primary objective achieved. Mission accomplished. I gotta hand it to you, kid. I've never seen Tanya stick her neck out for anybody. She's on an assignment back home, but she did ask me to convey any regards that she could uh, muster. Well, and, uh, at any rate, you, you must have really impressed those Germans, too. In appreciation, their chancellor has put us in touch with their leading citizen. Dr. Einstein, you still there? Yeah, yeah. I, I, I am here. One moment. Well, Commander. You know, of course, that war, it is not my vocation. I am only a scientist. But Soviet Premier Romanov and his generals, they will stop at nothing to rule the minds and the bodies of everyone on the planet. And they do have the psychic technology to do this. But I too, I know a few tricks. These are plans for a prism tower. Your president, he has expressed great interest in its application. Thanks, Doc. Commander? The Reds have established a forward base near DC with the ability to deploy Tesla coils. Now they're pretty well entrenched, but I think if we can take the capital back, we can turn the tide. I'm tired of hanging out in Canada. 
Get me my office back. Establishing battlefield control. Stand by. Reinforcements have arrived. Battle control online. Navigation Incoming transmission. Yeah, Commander, I have something very interesting to show you. Please, Peter, I want you to take a look. You see, when Prism Power X, it is placed close to Prism Power Y, the energy produced by the central power will be increased by a factor of X over Y times two. Beautiful, yeah? Our base is under attack. Sir, the Soviets have released their terror drones. If our tanks get too close, these mechanical arachnids will tear them to shreds. Mission accomplished. No rest for the weary, Commander. Sorry to wake you, but General Carville has called an emergency debriefing scheduled to begin in, um, right now. Good morning, Commander. I've got good news and bad news. Good news is it's uh, great to be home again. The bad news is our U-2s picked up a fleet of uh, Soviet ships entering the South Pacific. It appears that General Vladimir is headed for Pacific Command Center in Pearl Harbor, as if they could mount a successful attack against us. <laughs> I want you to prepare a genuine aloha for uh, that little bulldog Vladimir. Oh, and uh, get yourself a cup of coffee, Commander. You look deader than the Texas Armadillo. Establishing battlefield control. Stand by. Commander, there is no airborne threat that can invade the sight or missiles of the Aegis cruiser. It is the premier anti-air weapon. Sir, our aircraft carriers are the pride of the Allied Navy. In a moment's notice, the carrier's planes can take out any target quickly and from a very safe distance. Battle control online. Incoming transmission. Yes, sir. Unit report. Bound forward. Commencing assault. Sir, this is not looking good. If we don't get relief soon, we're finished. Unit ready. Navigation. Our al Mission accomplished. Beautiful job in Hawaii, Commander. I know you have your heart set on seeing the beach at Waikiki, but we have new business in St. Louis. The heart of Missouri is now the beating breast of all our ground control operations for the country. We'd be in sorry shape without her. The problem is that Yuri and his psychic corps have dropped another psychic beacon in the town. I never wanted to send you in against our own citizens. But those psychic beacons are turning upstanding Americans into Soviet-controlled killers. Move fast, move wisely. And try not to hurt any of my constituents. All right? Unfortunately, you may have to. Tanya's strike team is in place and standing by, but we can't tell how long they can go before the beacon takes its effect on them. One moment, Commander. Oh, she's not kidding, Commander. If we don't move fast enough, we'll all become slaves to Romanov and his slime ball Yuri. You understand what I'm saying? There's nothing worse for a soldier than losing her mind. We're trusting you. Establishing battlefield control. Stand by. Battle control online. Primary objective baby, achieved. Baby. On my way. Transmission. Unit reporting. Go. Commander, we think you're going to like this Bound one. Yes, sir. It's Einstein's prism tech on wheels. The boys at the lab call it a prism Don't tech. It, Careful not to burn yourself. Destination Mission accomplished. Soviet forces retreated or surrendered in several key areas today. Find out where on War Watch at 9.
Don't get too comfortable, Commander. Romanov still has plenty of fight left. Apparently the Soviets thought we wouldn't notice this research facility in the Yucatan. By these readings, we can see that they're trying to replicate Einstein's PRISM technology. Your destination is the ruined Mayan city of Tulum, near the Caribbean coast. We're para-dropping a SEAL team to help you locate and destroy the facility. I think you're gonna like these guys. Establishing battlefield control. Stand by. Commander, the SEAL team has liberated a group of local freedom fighters. They were kind enough to give us the location of a Soviet research facility in exchange for the opportunity to fight by our side. I didn't think you'd mind. Structure garrison. Mission accomplished. No rest for the wicked, Commander. We're both being shipped to Germany. I'm going to Berlin where we're planning our final thrust. Romanov is no fool. He's hitting us pretty hard over there. His main target is Einstein's Black Forest Lab. I want you to hook up with the locals. Keep him the Sam Hill away from that lab. Einstein is our ace in the hole. We can't afford to lose him. Off Wieders thing. Establishing battlefield control. Stand by. Incoming transmission. I have something very exciting for you, Commander. It is called my Mirage Tank. It has the wonderful ability to take on the exact appearance of any organic object it targets. Observe. You see it? Isn't she wonderful? Battle control online. Mission accomplished. We're all very sorry about General Carville, Commander. The Soviets have been using their crazy Ivans everywhere. Carville always said that you would be the one to lead us to victory. And it seems that you're proving him right. Commander, I have Professor Einstein on closed circuit channel 2. Allow me to say danke schön, Commander. Thank you for saving my home. I have something to... how shall we say? Even the score, yeah? You are aware, yeah, of my chronosphere. A device which it is capable of moving matter through time and through space. I have fought many long days and nights to find the perfect place where to deploy this weapon. There is only one small problem. The perfect place it is to be found here, on a tiny island in the Florida Keys, just a few short kilometers from Soviet Cuba. I, I must get back to work. This is the intel I've been able to gather regarding the Soviet nukes in the area. They'll make chronosphere deployment a real challenge. Good luck, Commander. Establishing battlefield control. Stand by. Incoming transmission. Commander, I thought I'd seen everything, but this takes the cake. You guessed it, mind-controlled squid. Intelligence informs me that effective countermeasures involve specially trained dolphins, which are now at your disposal. What's next? Killer whales? Good luck, Commander. Battle control online. Order New objective received. Incoming transmission. This message goes out to hidden, Commander. 
who continues to dance, but ceases to amuse. Now is time to submit to Soviet supremacy, Commander. After you feel pain from my nuclear bombs, you will wish for another chance. Unit lost. Incoming transmission. I warned you we would destroy you, Commander. Now that warning will... What? Disabled. The missiles have been disabled. But... Uh... <laughs> ah! Your time is up, Commander! And you will be crushed! Very soon! Mission accomplished. He served his country well, a proud American. And I know Carville would have been proud to see you succeed him as Commander General of the Allied Forces. General, we need you to take us the rest of the way. Next stop, the Kremlin. Special Agent Tanya has the job of moving inside the Kremlin and finding Romanov, who will pay for all the millions of innocent lives he took. Remember. We're still out number three to one, so we'll be marching everyone we can through the chronosphere and the keys. Once they appear in Russia, they're all yours, Commander. Take the Kremlin, Commander. Let's end this war. New objective received. Army man, going down! Oh! Oh! The primary objective achieved. Incoming transmission. Commander, reports from our chrono troops in the field indicate you are all clear. They're ready to receive your MCV. Teleporting troops arriving in 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Tech building captured. New objective received. It's Unit lost. Unit promoted. Unit ready. Unit lost. Building. Incoming transmission. Well, Commander, I have learned it is never a good idea to play around with the forces of nature. But with this evil Romanov running loose again, we have no choice. This weather control device provides very advanced manipulation of the weather patterns. These are God's toys, Commander. Use them wisely. Yep. Construction complete. Warning, nuclear missile launched. Warning, lightning storm created. Select target. Warning, Iron Curtain activated. Our base is under attack. Achieved.
After months of brutal fighting, Allied forces have captured Soviet Premier Romanov and his Kremlin command post late this afternoon in a dizzying show of high technology and good old military discipline. Much of the credit for the amazing success of the Allied campaign goes to a little-known commander from... When you're done patting yourself on the back, I have a little proposition for you. The President has invited you, us, to his victory gala at the White House tonight. I thought maybe you'd want to ride. Just listen for the sound of the healers. Oh, and for heaven's sake, get the showers, soldier. We will bury them. Comrade General, my name is Lieutenant Zofia. It will be my job to see that your command runs smoothly. I have assisted in over 50 successful campaign simulations since the Great War. I believe you will be more than satisfied with my services. Please stand by, comrade. It is Premier Romanov himself. If the lovely Lieutenant Sofia has finished pushing for promotion, I would like some time with my General, please. Of course, Premier. Comrade General, welcome to the future of Soviet Union. I wanted to introduce you to my little friend. This is Sam. Like Uncle Sam. Say hello, little uncle. <laughs> the Americans. They have turtle in children's film. It teaches them to fear Soviet Union. The little turtle sees big Russian missiles coming. And it ducks. And it covers. Duck. Cover. <laughs> Today we will make history, comrade. Together we will destroy the United States. Their cities, their homes, their dreams, and perhaps more. This is my advisor, Yuri. He will help make this possible. I am but a servant of the Soviet Union like you. However, at this moment we must hurry. Time is of the essence. Of course. Comrade, your first objective will be Washington, D.C. Show us that we were right to let you sit at our table, Comrade General. Crush the Allies in the American capital and destroy the Pentagon. Establishing battlefield control. Stand by. Reinforcements have arrived. Commander, this is the first step in our glorious conquest. Victory here is crucial. Remember, we must crush the Pentagon. Above all else, the Pentagon must be destroyed. Battle control on time. Units, turn around. The Pentagon is destroyed. Units promoted. Mission accomplished. Congratulations, Comrade General. See how the American President Dugan ducks for cover. <laughs> This is the coastal state of Florida. The Americans have a big naval base in the area. They could strike anywhere from New York to Havana. Comrade, you will need to build a naval base of your own with submarines to keep the weak Allied Navy from reaching open sea. General Vladimir, who needs no introduction, will oversee the operation and provide you with support from his command ship. Tazadanya. Good luck. <laughs> But of course, comrade, show us what you can do. But don't think that I will allow you to order me around. Romanov can say what he likes. Out there, you follow me. And I will be watching you every step of the way. Establishing battlefield control. Stand by. Stage 2, Sitting obligation. Ah! New mission objective received. Unit level control on time. Transmission. Comrade General, General Vladimir is calling for you to clear out coastal defenses. It could be a good time for you to build up your naval base. Construction complete. Incoming transmission. Now is the time to strike! 
Glory to the motherland! But sir, we are not ready. Not enough submarines are built for- Nonsense! I could destroy this American Navy with a little rubber dog. Incoming ah! transmission. General, it appears we might have underestimated Allied forces. What are you waiting for, General? Do something! The Typhoon attack sub is undetected. Reinforcements have arrived. Mission accomplished. Our nation's top leaders presided over the parades today in Red Square to celebrate the ongoing victory over the United States. Premier Romanov himself presented the Order of Stalin to the hero of the campaign, General Vladimir. We both know the truth, comrade. Just because Vladimir can retreat to Moscow more quickly does not mean he should take all credit, right? But no matter, let me share something with you. The human brain is a Pandora's box of electrical charges we can only begin to understand. Most brains are but receivers. However, some are advanced, sending and receiving charges as they choose. This is my psychic beacon. With it, we can send any message we want. We will construct this device everywhere. In the end, the Americans will be ours. Mind, body, and if you like, soul. Comrade, begin the psychic invasion in New York City. A victory there could not possibly escape Romanov's eyes. Incoming transmission. Waiting order. Comrade General. The Premier requests that you capture the pathetic capitalist shrine in New York called the World Trade Center. After you overwhelm the American defenses in the area, plant a psychic beacon to secure our control. Welcome to New York, Commander. Capture the Allied Battle Lab at the World Trade Center and use their technology to build the psychic beacon. New construction. Move ready. Examining diagram. I have the information. I will Structure sold. The beacon lost. Beacon deployed and online. Our base is under attack. Can't concentrate. Voice in my head. Victory to the soldier! Yes, sir! Over Mission Form up! All ships, at the ready! We have a situation that requires your immediate attention, Comrade General. The Republic of Korea has made a move we did not anticipate. I am tracking Korean vessels en route to what I expect to be a landing near Vladivostok. Comrade General, Premier requests your immediate attention. I'll put you through. Ah, comrade! I was just reassuring Comrade Yuri we have nothing to fear from the Republic of Korea. Perhaps the Premier is forgetting he must remind the world of his eminence. Yes, well... Yes. But do not be troubled. The General here, after doing so well with New York, surely can handle the threat. Perhaps. But I, I think we should call Vladimir. As you wish, Comrade Premier. General. Da! He is war hero. He needs rest. <laughs> Take care of the Republic of Korea, Comrade. Show them how we treat our enemies. Ready, comrade. New construction options. Building. I have displayed the estimated time remaining until the Allied fleet arrives, Commander. Construction options. Incoming transmission. Comrade, 
I have just received a demonstration brief of our terrifying new anti-armor weapon. They are affectionately referred to as terror drones. Do you like, comrade? I thought you might like to play rough in battle. On hold. Mission accomplished. With the United States reeling from one bloody blow after the other, President Michael Dugan today called to European allies from an unknown location. I now ask for your help. The United States was Romanov's first target. Join our fight, or we will not be his last. French General René Lyon has asked for a massive Allied commitment, but so far the countries have been slow to up. Comrade, it appears we have overestimated the cowardice of our European neighbors. It seems the French gathered together with the German army along the Polish border. But these fools have left their homelands exposed. Show them the meaning of Soviet irony. Invade Paris and use our Tesla technology to short-circuit their plans. Leave nothing. Incoming transmission. If you are prepared, the General, your strike team is assembled in Paris. I always like the City of Lights. Pity we cannot be there in person when the lights go out. I think you will like this, General. The demolitions expert known as Crazy Ivan is among your forces here. He will be well suited for the task at hand. Unit lost. Incoming transmission. Comrade General, we must move closer to the tower. If we are to secure a good charge, insufficient funds. Unit ready. Mission accomplished. Thousands of Parisians fleeing their homes today is absolute chaos, Jim. We don't even know if there's a president out there to call. Wait! The United States is at its knees. We all dis. Victory to superior leadership on the part of yourself and General Vladimir. Thank you. Your greatness is only exceeded by your general. I am a special announcement to greet our latest success. I am now promoting Yuri as Supreme Commander of Soviet Armed Forces. What? Effective immediately. You are behind this, Yuri. I know this for a fact. It appears all Vladimir is unhappy. Pity. We have work to do, General. The Allied Pacific Fleet gathers near Hawaii. You are destroyed the Allied fleet at Pearl Harbor and establish a new presence for us. Establishing battlefield control. Stand by. <laughs> Battle control online. Ship reporting. Vessel ready. Yes, commander. Engaged. Waiting on. Moving. Changing position. New construction options. Primary mission accomplished. Shanua. Good evening. Brilliant as usual, I see. However, I have sad news. Vladimir, you should hear this too before it goes public. Premier Romanov has fallen ill and will no longer be able to perform his duties. Really? But that is not our immediate concern. The Allies have turned to the German professor Albert Einstein, who has built for them a chronosphere, a mass teleportation device. My intelligence sources have pinpointed their first target, our own research laboratory in the Ural Mountains. It is my belief that the Allies will attempt to steal our plans for their new apocalypse tank. Oh. And did your intelligence not warn you that Einstein would get involved? Or is he not vulnerable to your vulturous mind? Yes. That will be enough! You are a traitor! 
And a fool if you think that I will let you get away Enough, with General Vladimir! My tanks, my Consider soldiers. yourself dismissed. And count your days. General, defend our mountains. I'll give the Premier your best wishes. Building. Incoming transmission. I think we should send a few dogs to sniff out enemy spies. Our base is under attack. Our unit lost. Incoming transmission. Something you should be aware of. General Carville has stationed a truck near one of our villages. He has been broadcasting capitalist propaganda in an attempt to turn our own people against us. We cannot deploy here. No! No! Primary objective achieved. Mission accomplished. Generals, soldiers, comrades, it is a sad day. Premier Alexander Romanov, so recently ill in bed, has been brutally murdered by General Vladimir. No! General Vladimir! As of this moment, 9.15 in the evening, General Vladimir is a non-person. He is now considered refused to be collected. I sense that he is holed up here at the White House, home of the corrupt. Capture the White House and find this non-person. Then you can erase him as we have already erased his name. General, do not listen to Yuri's lies! He is not... Pay no attention, Comrade General. He no longer means anything to us. We now have a more important task at hand. The American President Dugan has surfaced here in San Antonio, Texas. Perhaps he intends to retreat to the Alamo. Recapture him and bring him under our control. Establishing battle control. Stand by. Listen to me, you Soviet scum. You can root around all you want, but you'll never find me, and you'll never take me. You call yourself a general? <laughs> We're laughing at you, Red. Battle control online. Mission accomplished. I think it is time we had a talk, you and I. When the Soviet Union was new, there were those of us that Stalin turned to for our particular skills. We were trained to turn men's minds to our will. This is Stalin's psychic legacy. I tell you this, because you are too smart not to be curious. We have situation that odd little man Einstein has provided the Allies with a device that harnesses the energy from storm clouds overhead. Almost whimsical, but effective. Destroy this device with the nuclear missiles I will provide you and get our forces moving again. General, by now I have folded Vladimir's command into yours. The weather control device appears to be here in the US Virgin Islands. Sir, I am not quite clear on your intentions, but if you have a move in mind, now is the time to tell me. Establishing battlefield control. Stand by. Greetings, Commander. Your forces need to invade the Allied base and take over their battle. Get an engineer in there so you can pinpoint the location of their super weapon. We 
When your men are ready, I suggest you begin your assault here, Commander. This beach is well defended, but it is also the only place to land your troops effectively. Good luck, sir. Metal control online. New terrain discovered. Aha! There it is. Elevator control device. Luckily, Intel says it could possibly be operational here. Comrade General, you are proving even more tenacious than I thought. What a great threat you are to your enemies. Do me this favor. Grace me with your presence in Moscow, so I may thank you in person. Before you go anywhere, you should see this. It arrived today. To be mailed in the event of Premier's death. If you have received this, then I, I presume by now I am finally dead. I'm losing. I don't know how to... Oh, Mother Russia. I'm forgetting words. Bah! Yuri. He is controlling my mind. He has killed me. If I am gone now, the command is yours. Send this tape far and wide. Take my country back for the glory of Russia and the spirit of justice. I think you are satisfied now, Da. Yuri has his own stronghold here outside Moscow, and he is amassing his own forces. But the bulk of the army is yours. Don't. Don't speak, General. They are listening for you now. If we do not speak again, it has been an honor to serve you. Establishing battlefield control. Stand Yuri will destroy us all. He must be stopped, no matter what the cost. New construction option. Battle control on the other side. Incoming transmission. Be warned, Comrade General. Yuri has rebuilt the Iron Curtain. It will make his troops invulnerable for a period of time. Building. Incoming. Transmission. No one will ever catch us off guard now, Comrade. I have obtained plans for the Psychic Sensor. This device will warn us of any troop movements within its range. We can sleep well once again. Warning, nuclear missile launch. Mission accomplished. While the nation has lost its beloved premier and its great general Vladimir at the hands of the traitor Yuri, we all turn our eyes to the supreme commander who still fights the bloody battle against the Allied forces. General, I have accessed Yuri's files, and he has provided us, shall we say, with a parting gift. The Allies think we do not know about this chronosphere in Alaska, from which they hope to launch a full-scale invasion. This is all they have left. It will be good to crush their hopes. And when it is done, you will be ready to become Premier of the world. Incoming transmission. Comrade General, I must warn you. The Allied chronosphere could be our undoing. The first step is a swift naval assault. They will not be expecting us here, and that will be their undoing. Unit lost. Everywhere, citizens are honoring the new Soviet premier. We will now go to London. People in the streets, truly the finest hour is premier. It has been decades since we've seen anything quite like this. Uh, wait, uh, here comes the new premier himself. 
would have been good to see inside your mind, General. I still may get a chance.